It's another video from Aussie's Robot. But you got the banana collection. All right, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome back. And thank you for joining me on another cool toy video for your toy enjoyment. <laughs> Today we have a very rare boxed ray gun. And as always, before I get into it, get comfortable, my friends. Grab your morning cup of joe, if that's what you're doing, if that's what time it is where you're at. And uh, clank it up a bit, stir it, sweeten it, and get comfortable in your favorite chair, wherever you're at. Unless you're at work and you're doing this on the sly and you can't let anyone know that you're watching this. In which case, do it in stealth mode with your VPN, <laughs> with your, what's that VPN that always advertises? All the YouTubers tell you to get, uh, I don't know, I forgot which VPN it is. Plus, I don't want to give anybody a plug unsolicited anyway. But anyway, if you've done all that and you're munching on a breakfast burrito or something of that nature, maybe it's a healthy, I don't know, celery stick, and uh, you're paying attention now, you may have seen this on my live stream that was live at one point and it no longer is youtube is still managing to remove views from my live stream for some ex unexplicable reason they must not want me to be popular like the popular kids i feel ostracized by youtube they they better um they better treat me like better in the cool kids club you know or else i'll have to lodge a formal protest of some kind but anyway um if you were watching my live stream you saw that i you know i do a segment where i go through ebay and we look for bargains together and if there's something that i have that i think might be of interest to you i say this is a bargain this would be something i would consider if you're a collector so in this case i saw something that interested me and not so much the gun although now that i have the gun i think it's actually very cool but I saw the box and I said, man, I really dig this box art. And here it is. It's this ray gun. This was a buy it now for 55 big ones. That's $55 if you're keeping track. Not euros or uh, yen or yuans or uh, pounds, British pounds, but no dollars. And I said, you know what? I would have paid probably a couple hundred just for this box. I liked it so much. So... What was it that got me so enthralled? Well, it's this cool space scene of this dude, this Astro Boy, not Astro Boy to be confused with Astro Boy, the um, cyborg robot, well, robot kid. I mean, just this astronaut boy looking character that is holding his ray gun and shooting something for no apparent reason. And he's in this billowy suit and helmet. Now his face is kind of obscured but I'm thinking he was a young buck. But it's just the whole scenery is really cool. I mean, it's got these like, like very detailed craters and a nicely detailed rocket ship and a nice detailed planet. You got stars and you got all kinds of stuff going on there. It's just a really, really nice um, illustration. And the font itself, look at it, the ray gun. It looks like, I don't know if that's supposed to be on fire down there or it's just two-tone or if it's some kind of weird cityscape but it's just everything about it scream the quality scream the 1950s you know uh, artistry mid-century modern and even his belt has like a cool apparatus and he's shooting it it's got some kind of plasma beam injecting on it uh, or laser so it was a no-brainer for 55 you get the toy in the box and then over here it almost looks like a wood grain Looks like my Maybach has what they call the flowing lines. That's what it's got, the flowing lines. It's inlaid with red flowing lines and it says ray gun. In case you were confused and it has a different font that says ray gun. So it's actually a total of three fonts they use. You have font number one, then you have font number two and font number three. So I imagine they had to go through three different fonts to do this, and it's a ray gun with spark. But you know, once I got, so beyond this beautiful box, I think this is beautiful. I, I honestly got a, not, I'm not a big ray gun guy, like I have a, quite a bit now, but 
I don't have any out yet for display other than I think a couple that are just rifles kind of sitting on the side. You can't really even see them on the bottom of, of a display cabinet. But anyway, um, you know, my guns, I need to find those things that hold it. But then once I got this, I said, this is really cool. It's got like this, you know, I don't know what you call this attachment. Let's call it the plasma diffuser or the laser diffuser or the beam the beam disruptor because it turns, I guess, like one laser beam into four laser beams. And that's, of course, where you would have your sparking if the flint was still any good, which this isn't. Uh, you know, I checked. It's a really cool style. And it's very petite. It's, a, it's kind of almost like a, a rocket ship um, design to it. Nice colors, nice lightning bolt on it. Nice, you know, I guess you could call this the fourth font. Man, they really went font crazy on this. Really nice trigger. I mean, even though the gun's petite, the trigger isn't. So you have your ray gun here and, you know, the, the purpose is to, you know, get it to emit the sparks. But like I said, the flint's expired so, or worn out. I don't see any sparking, I don't know if you do. So you could consider that almost like a space sound also. If you go too fast, you have that. You wanna do it slow. This one, this gun takes a little finesse to get the right sound. See if you go too fast. I could probably, like I always say, I could stick some lube in there, but you know, then I gotta worry about the grease coming out and screwing something up. So I don't do that. But anyway, for 55 big ones, I said this was a slam dunk. And I'm gonna get close. Whoop. So the moral of the story, my friends, is if you watch my live streams, you might come across a phenomenal bargain. And I, I would tell you, buy it, buy it. It's a good deal. <laughs> so in other words, if I came across this one again, I'd say for $55, I'd say buy it, buy it. It's a good deal. So you never know. Watching my live stream might be of financial benefit to you. Although disclaimer, there's no guarantees. But again, you never know. And with that... Thanks for watching. If you like ray guns or tin toys or the sound of my strange voice, whatever it is that compels you to watch this, you know what? Thumb up the video. Leave a remark. Let me know what you think. And if you're a non-subscriber, the best thing you could do for humanity at this point is subscribe to the channel and buck YouTube's shadow banning algorithms <laughs> you know that's the other positive of doing that so with that thanks again for your time and joining me and i'll talk to you later